Welcome in, welcome in my beautiful souls. It is your girl Wounded Healer of Tarot and I am back again with another reading care for you today. This will be a general reading for the sign Gemini. So if you so happen to have Gemini anywhere in your birth chart, but specifically your sun, your moon, your rising, your Venus, your north node, this message is indeed intended for you. But this is only a general reading, so take what messages resonates for you. This is also a timeless read. So whenever you find this message or this message finds you, just know that it was meant for you at that time. All right. So no further ado, Gemini. Let's see what it is that your guides need you to see here and know most importantly at this time for your highest good. Holy Spirit, my angels, my ancestors calling on you, asking that you place divine protection over me as I go into the divination of tarot what's going on in gemini's energy holy spirit what's going on in gemini's energy holy spirit what's going on in gemini's energy holy spirit what is it that they need to see hear and know It looks like you're investing in something. This could be a business. This could be a relationship. This could be a partnership. This could even be just something having to do with self. You're investing into something. Maybe you are questioning, is something paying off? Maybe you're questioning, is it even growing? Is something here blossoming? It's like you are... You're unsure. Let's see what's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini. Yeah, the King of Pentacles in reverse. Maybe you invested in something and something went wrong. It could have turned eerie. Maybe you felt like you could have been a little bit too quick with moving on to something. Maybe you feel like you jumped the gun. Okay, what's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Why is this King of Pentacles in reverse? Why is this King of Pentacles in reverse? Ooh. Somebody here, something backfired, Gemini. Something backfired. You were planning something to go one way and boom, it went another way. For some of you, this could be involving some form of magic, some form of spell work, some form of divination. If you're into any kind of divination, Gemini. What's going on, Holy Spirit? With Gemini that you need them to see, hear, and know. What's going on, Holy Spirit? Maybe, okay, what's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Page of Cups. Queen of Cups. Somebody here definitely is diving into some form, some some form of divination. Okay, somebody here absolutely deals with certain like creating maybe potions or um, creating or 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 reciting certain rituals. Somebody here definitely is in tune with their magical side. And if this is not your energy, Gemini, it's involving someone who has Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in their chart. What's going on, Holy Spirit? What is it that you need me to see here and know surrounding Gemini? What's going on? What's the message? What's the message here for Gemini? Holy Spirit that you need me to see, hear, and know. What's going on? The 
course, but it's in reverse. Something here is not moving forward. The hawk, the ego, omens, messages, connection to the angelic realm. Gemini, somebody is getting ready to receive a wake-up call. Somebody is about to receive a wake-up call. Holy Spirit, what's going on for Gemini? Somebody is about to receive a wake-up call. What's going on? Romance, illusion, seeking the sacred. Somebody might even be coming in with an apology. Gemini, somebody may be asking for your forgiveness. For some of you, this is involving a relationship. For some of you, this is involving a partnership. Something here backfired. Something here is not moving forward. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Some of you could be born on June 26. I know that that is Cancer's energy. Okay? But some of you could be on the cusp. You can have Cancer in your chart somewhere. What's going on, Holy Spirit? The Queen of Pentacles. King and Queen of Pentacles is both in reverse. It's like somebody here is trying to block you in some sort of way. Somebody here is trying to restrict you in some sort of way. Yes, somebody here is trying to create barriers. Somebody here is trying to cause some sort of delay in your life. It has to do with... This could be involving a Libra or this has to do with the law being involved. Maybe somebody here could have or somebody here could be facing jail time. Somebody here could be facing prison time. That's also maybe that could be why you're feeling like things um, backfire. Maybe you are on this streak or this path of things really going good with the seven of coins. But then boom, something took a turn. Okay, somebody here is, you're faced with some sort of reality of the truth on what it is. It's something here you know. Okay, what's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini that you need them to see here and know what's going on? What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? King and Queen of Pentacles is both in reverse. What's going on, Holy Spirit? So somebody here is out of balance. Somebody here is out of alignment. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini that you need them to see, hear, and know? What's going on, Holy Spirit? Thank you. Okay. Some of you, there may be some sort of traveling plans involved. Okay, or if that's not the case, somebody here is traveling towards you. Again, it feels like somebody wants to come in with some sort of apology. It feels like somebody here wants to try to fix whatever has taken place. You could be seeing 1111. For some of you, yes, this has to do with your divine counterpart. For some of you, there could have been some something here involving a, a relationship. Just say, for instance... You and this person got into an argument and then the police got involved and then it just seems like it knocked everything out of place. I'm picking up that kind of energy. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Some of you may be needing to take out some sort of loan. Some of you may need to, you may be finding yourself at the bank more often than usual. If this has nothing to do with the bank, for some of you, it feels like there may be some sort of something you, I'm not going to say the word borrow, but it's, it feels like you're finding yourself in debt. You're finding yourself in a bind. I'm hearing off that movie, um, set it off. She said, I'm in a bind, Nate. And that's not me putting a joke in it. It's like somebody here is finding themselves in a bind. For some of you, this bond this bond, this bind, I'm saying bind, but bond. Somebody here maybe is trying to bond somebody out of jail. Okay, period. Something here happened. Something here 
Some of you may need to pay a lawyer. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Yeah, I'm in a bind, Nate. Some of you absolutely is struggling. You may need more support than usual. You may need more help than usual. For If this is not about you, maybe you're needing more help. If you have children, just say for instance, maybe your kids are needing more things and you don't have all the funds. It seems like somebody here is needing some sort of assistance. Some sort of help. It's something here that somebody here is struggling with. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? What's, for some of you, you could be actually, somebody here could have um, had some sort of injury. That could also be why somebody here is needing more assistance, needing more help. What's going on for Gemini, Holy Spirit? That could be why somebody here is traveling towards you. Maybe to come help out more. Okay, what's going on, Holy Spirit? Yes. Somebody here is feeling down on their luck. Somebody here is feeling emotionally drained in some sort of area. Yes, the magician. It feels like maybe this is the reason why magic is involved. Spell work is involved. It feels like maybe you need some sort of turnaround because you're feeling down on your luck. What's going on, Holy Spirit? You know, maybe you just was surrounding the wrong group of people. Maybe, you know, these people that you were surrounding yourself with, the environment that you were surrounding yourself with, maybe this is how you ended up in some sort of trouble. For some of you, it is legal trouble. Yes. What's going on? What's going on, Holy Spirit? Somebody has found themselves in some sort of trouble and you're trying to find a way out. Okay. What's going on, Holy Spirit? Some of you, this could be surrounding a Virgo Capricorn Taurus. A lot of earth energy showing up, okay? Somebody here, it also feels like, if that's not the case of you trying to find your way out of some sort of bond, Maybe somebody you know is trying to get out of a bond. Maybe they're coming to you for some sort of guidance. Maybe they're coming to you for some sort of help. I literally heard seek guidance. So for some of you, you're needing to seek some sort of guidance. For some of you, somebody is seeking some sort of guidance towards you. Maybe you're looking to have some sort of lasting impact. Maybe you're feeling like something here It's like somebody feels like something is digging a hole deeper. And what's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? What's going on? What's the message, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Right now, somebody needs rescuing. Somebody needs rescuing. It feels like somebody here needs somebody to just put on this Superman, Superwoman cape. Somebody's Mars is in Leo. There's a lot of things that has taken place. Absolutely. What's going on, Holy Spirit? There's some things that has taken place and it has shifted the way things have at one point were going. Absolutely. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Yes, definitely. For some of you, you're going to have to, you're finding yourself, you're, or you're going to find yourself having to sit down for some time. What are you showing me, Spirit? Okay, what are you showing me? See? 
the Sage of Pentacles in reverse coming with the Nine of Pentacles. It's like you were on this like winning streak. And then boom, something took a turn. Something you were investing in. Something you were nurturing. Something you were tending to. What are you showing me, spirit? Somebody here is having to put out some sort of fire. Somebody here is needing some sort of rescuing. Somebody here is needing some sort of rescuing. I don't know how to make it much clearer. Somebody here is needing some, some sort of rescuing. Holy Spirit, what is it that you need Gemini to see, hear, and know? Somebody feels like they're walking on thin ice. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini that you need them to see, hear, and know? What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Somebody here feels constricted, conflicted, restricted, confined. Somebody here feels like there has been some sort. For some of you, you may, if this has to do with the law, for some of you, you may find yourself on a bracelet. For some of you, you may find yourself having to check in with your PO. For some of you, you may have been put on a temporary hold. Okay? What's going on, Holy Spirit? For Gemini. What's going on, Holy Spirit? For Gemini. You're being told to raise your vibrations, okay? Yes, the star in the Queen of Cups. You're being told to raise your vibrations. It feels like there is an imbalance going on. It, it, you're needing to confront something here. You're needing to face something here. Somebody here is needing to get back into alignment. Something has you thrown off. Something has you feeling all sorts of ways. For some of you, you're starting to see something. Let's, let's dive a little bit deeper. What's going on, Holy Spirit? Let's dive a little bit deeper. For Gemini. What's going on, Holy Spirit? For Gemini. That you need them to see, hear, and know. Something here you haven't allowed to end. Something here is still not over. Okay? Maybe you thought you were at a certain point in your life, but it feels like, again, something here is like you've taken some few steps back. Maybe that's, or you're feeling like there's been a few steps that has been taken black, back. Okay? The transformation card, death card, Scorpio energy. Some of you, you have Scorpio in your chart. What's going on with this death card in reverse? The sun in reverse. Something here truly has had an impact on you. Yes. Something here has truly affected you in some sort of way. Maybe you're feeling like you're in a dark place, okay? But your intuition is guiding you at this time. Gemini. Some of you are feeling discombobulated. You're feeling out of sorts. There was, there is, if, if this has not already taken place, there's going to be something that takes place that you're going to feel has disrupted your life. Again, I said you were, you're starting to see something. For some of you, it's starting something with internally that you're starting to see. 
okay? Your intuition is nudging you on something here, okay? What's going on with this intuition, Holy Spirit? For some of you, this is surrounding maybe like um, your home front, like people that you may live with um, or people that you share a home with. For some of you, this is surrounding like your happiness, okay? That could be also what you're starting to see. Maybe you realizing that you've been carrying a lot of burdens that you're needing to let go of, that you've been carrying. Okay, what, is, what else, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? You're needing to definitely get back rooted and grounded. There is you needing to truly connect with your chakras where you're ba basically getting back into alignment. Yes, Holy Spirit, what's going on for Gemini? What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Thank you. Yes. You're, somebody here is really needing to get back into alignment with their emotions. Maybe your emotions are all over the place right now. It seems like you're seeking some sort of balance, some sort of harmony, some sort of peace. Yes, your guys are telling you to trust your gut instincts. You already know something. You're sensing something. You're feeling something. Again, you're seeing something here, the intuition. Something also highlighting your solar plastic chakra. So this could be also about the way you are showing up. Okay. Somebody here is basically being told to remain in faith. Okay. Remain hopeful. Somebody here could be 27 years of age, 48 years of age. And again, your intuition is very highlighted at this time. Maybe you're needing to connect with music. Maybe that could help you raise your vibration. But you're being told to trust the guidance you are receiving. Okay, trust the insight you are receiving at this time, Gemini. Somebody, if I haven't said it already, could be 41 years of age, 33 years of age, and 44 years of age. Your ascendant masters are definitely showing up with a lot of um, 33s, 43s. Um, you could also be seeing 222, 666. What are you showing me, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? What's the message? Okay. Some of you could be connecting with, um, you, you may be a part of some sort of tribe, like Cherokee. You may have like Native American in your, um, in your um, DNA for some of you. Um, for some of you, you are connecting with, um, with like you may have, got you. you. There may be, like you may be, connect, you may feel a strong connection with like Egyptians, like the Egyptian gods, the Egyptian goddesses, right? Like that's the energy that I'm picking up on. What else, Holy Spirit? See, yes, Egypt. See, yeah, you may have a strong connection here with Egypt. I'm hearing the Sphinx. That's a hit. Oh, Jesus. What are you showing me, spirit? Okay, let's let's just shuffle and see what comes through. They just showed me a card. I'm not going to speak on it just yet. Oh, what's going on, Holy Spirit? You may have a connection with Goddess Isis. That's also connecting me with your intuition. The Eye of Horus. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini?
it's going right back to that six of pentacles five of pentacles somebody here is needing some sort of assistance somebody here is needing some sort of help you're going through a challenging time right now there's an obstacle you're going through absolutely yes somebody something having to do with the law something having to do with the judicial system there's something let's get a little bit more we got growth that came out so again this is a part of you needing to allow something to end but the rebirth card is in reverse the transformation card is in reverse so it's like you're stuck between a rock and a hard place that's what it also feels like somebody here feels like they're maybe not from this world you feel different you feel unique you may feel like you're not fitting in and bottom of the deck is accident maybe there's going to be some sort of accident that's Okay, let's get into this law. What's going on, Holy Spirit? What is it that is needing to come through with the law? What's the message? What's the message on this law, Holy Spirit? It's like somebody here is going to come knock on your door and deliver some papers to you and say you've been served. Like that's in the death card is at the bottom of the deck. For some of you, are you going through a divorce? What's going on, Holy Spirit, with the law? What's the message with the law? Something is changing. There's something changing. And again, I feel like somebody here is doing some sort of magic. I'm hearing it again. I'm in a bind, Nate. What's going on, Holy Spirit? What's the message? Patience in reverse. Somebody here. Yes, I'm in a bind. So somebody feels like they need to do something right now. The moon. Maybe fears are getting in the way. Temptation is getting in the way. It's like, it's like yeah, thorns. Maybe you feel like it's just like nothing is nothing else is going to come of this situation. It's like somebody here is just feeling like they're at their wits end with something. For some of you, this has to do with love. Yes. And again, your guides are saying um, there's a transformation that is needing to take place. For some of you, this is having to do with the relationship. Again, I said you could be going through a divorce. Okay. Judgment is coming. Okay. Yes. Something having to do with the law. What is going on? Holy Spirit, what are you showing me that I need to see, hear, and know? Gemini. What is it that you want them to see here and know? There's going to be some sort of risk you're having to take. Maybe you feel like you're needing to take some sort of risk. Maybe that could be also why you're feeling like, I got to get on it now. Okay? I got to get on it now. But your guys are saying you're being a little bit too impatient. Gemini. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Okay. Yeah, something here. Okay. Got you. What's going on, Holy Spirit? You have a lot of protection around you, Gemini, okay? Um, and they bring it right back out. What is spirit? Okay, let's start with this one. Some of you, this is about you realizing the potential that you have in certain areas of your life. Take that part as it resonates. Some of you could be 43 years of age, okay? Some of you are realizing or trying to realize the potential, okay? Maybe this could also t tie into a, your, the part of your growth. We got growth coming through three times. Right here, transformation and transformation, okay? But the divine physician is in reverse. Somebody here may be di diving into magic. I'm going back to it. And you're doing something totally wrong. You're doing something totally wrong. What is this divine physician 
in the reverse. What is this divine physician in reverse? Maybe you think you know what you're doing in some sort of way, but it feels like something is just not connecting. You got to realize the power that you have as well. So that also is speaking power. That is also speaking um, into whatever it is that you're doing. Yes, queen of sports. There's spirits inside of somebody. What are you showing me, spirit? Divine position in reverse, king of swords. What are you showing me? Justice. Libra energy. The knave of pentacles. Here it is again. Somebody's going to come knocking on your door, trying to give you some sort of gift. But it's like, voila, a surprise. It's going to be something else. Be careful with taking, receiving certain gifts from people. Okay? Period. Be careful with receiving certain gifts from people. The law is showing up again. Justice. Libra energy. I need to get down to the bottom line of this law. What's the message here, Holy Spirit? What are you showing me with the law? For Gemini. What are you showing me with the law? The chariot. I see a lot of paperwork here. Okay. Maybe you have to go to the courtroom to file, file some paperwork. Maybe you need to fill out some paperwork. Maybe you need to sign some papers. What's going on, Holy Spirit, with justice? The ace of swords, the six of cups. Here it is again. Somebody here is bringing some sort of gift. I don't know if you can trust it, though. It's like the truth is coming to the surface. The truth is being revealed. The Ace of Swords. What is? The, maybe the truth is coming to the light about a, a lover. Maybe somebody was hiding something from you. Yeah, Ten of Cups right behind that. Maybe somebody was hiding something from you. What are you showing me with this Ace of Swords and this Six of Cups spirit? I know this reading has been all over. Queen of Swords in reverse. Somebody here, I'm telling you, they're whatever it is, it backfired. A Lannister always pays his debts. Listen, somebody here is receiving karma. It's judgment. It's judgment day for your enemies, period. Somebody here is receiving karma. There's a lot of communication coming in. Okay, a lot of communication coming in. Look at that. Justice landing in my hand. Not once, but twice. Not 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 once, not twice, not three times, but four times. Justice is here. Somebody coming through with some sort of message. Okay. Libra is showing up so heavy in this reading somebody betrayed you okay they tied your hands behind your back you couldn't do that by yourself gemini somebody betrayed you three 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 on the clock somebody betrayed you hmm All right, Spirit, what, where, where do you want me to go? Where do, you, where, where do you want me to go, Spirit? All right. What's going on for Gemini? The Ten of Pentacles, the World card, and the Sun. I'm putting these back, but... This is having to do with children. This could be it. something. Maybe somebody, I'm hearing divorce court. There could be a divorce involved. A separation involved. And look at that. Split the deck on the magician. Somebody here is definitely diving into magic. What's going on, Holy Spirit, with this justice? The hangman 
and the seven of wands. Somebody here, maybe somebody here could be trying to cover up some evidence. Maybe somebody here could be trying to hide their hand, okay? The lovers and the ten of swords. And the seven of cups. There is some sort of illusion around it. Whatever, if there's an illusion going on. There's something tied to illusions, romance, illusions, seeking the sacred. The lovers, maybe there could be a third party situation. Maybe somebody here is really having like a toll on their body. Maybe you're needing to go to the doctor to get some sort of like physical work done. Okay. Maybe everything that's been going on has been just really taking a toll on you. Gemini. But the lovers is here. That's your energy as well. What's going on with this lovers spirit? For Gemini. Let's use this deck. What's going on with the lovers for Gemini, Holy Spirit? What's going on with the lovers for Gemini, Holy Spirit? Something here having to do with magic. I'm trying to tell you. Maybe somebody, what is, what? I'm about to get off this energy, Gemini. Somebody is watching something. Somebody is watching something or someone. But look, but somebody here is trying to unplug the computer. So it's like somebody here is trying to stop somebody from saying something. Somebody here is trying to hide their hand. Somebody here is trying to hide some sort of evidence. What's going on, Holy Spirit? Five of Cups in reverse. Five of Wands. There was definitely some sort of struggle with something. Something here fell apart. Look at the cups on the floor. Something here fell apart. Something here fell apart. The Ace of Wands. Somebody here was de dealing with magic. I'm trying to... Okay. Some, we, we know that we've made that very clear. Somebody here has been doing... They're trying to pull something. They're trying to pull a string. They're trying to pull something out of their hat. They're trying to make magic happen. We made that, that has been made very clear. Somebody here has definitely, it could be a Leo in your energy or somebody with Leo in their chart, okay? Somebody here is trying to cover up some sort of evidence, okay? really happened and got set on fire maybe you do need a, a fire extinguisher okay something happened i'm telling you the police is involved the law is involved spirit is involved spirits are involved like some stuff is going on for real Spirit advice for Gemini. Advice for Gemini. They want me to use another deck, but we'll see if anything comes right out. Okay. advice holy spirit you're yeah you're going to receive some sort of gift you're going to receive some sort of gift somebody here is asking for forgiveness i'm trying to tell you somebody feels so bad for what they have done 
or somebody is going to feel so bad for what they have done. What is going on for Gemini? Death card in reverse. Death card is here twice in reverse. Surprise in reverse. Thoughts in reverse. Somebody here is losing their marbles. Somebody here, something here backfired. The widower. Something here backfired. Somebody here could definitely have been trying to do some sort of death spell. Some sort of death magic. Jesus, I'm about to cleanse my energy. Hold on. What's going on, Holy Spirit? What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? In Gemini's reading. Ooh. Tell me what's going on. What is going on in Gemini's reading? Somebody was doing something they ain't had no business doing. Period. What's going on, Holy Spirit? Advice. All right. It's time to use another deck. All right. going on holy spirit for gemini yeah the truth is gonna come to the light whatever somebody was doing in the dark is coming to the light okay what's going on holy spirit for gemini what's going on holy spirit for gemini somebody may be finding out that they're pregnant what's going on holy spirit for gemini yeah, some def somebody here definitely intensified something. What's going on, Holy Spirit, for Gemini? Rebirth. There's it's it's a time for a transformation. A rebirth. It's time. Something here is it's time to end something here. Okay. Something here also for some of you. It's like you have like a magic wand. Or somebody around you has been doing some form of divination. Some form of magic. What's going on, Holy Spirit? This is a masculine energy who has been doing it. Yes, they have. Yes, they're trying to hide their hand. Yes, they are. They're trying to cover up something. And again, somebody here is doing some sort of magic. The same old messages. They're trying to hide their identity. They're trying to cloak their identity. Maybe somebody here thinks that they are the Lord. They think that they are God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Some It flipped out. Somebody here is trying to hide their identity. Somebody here is trying to cloak their identity. You're being guided to protect yourself. Shield yourself. Okay? Um, Gemini. Let me mix this up. You're being told to shield your energy, protect your energy, Gemini. I'm telling you, somebody here has been doing death spells. I'm some wicked energy. I'll tell you that one. Some wicked, wicked energy. Holy Spirit, what's the final message that we have here? For Gemini. Final message. Final message for Gemini. Holy Spirit. You could be seeing birds specifically falcons 
they're they're coming to deliver you some sort of message okay gemini somebody here has been strategizing i'm trying to tell you they're acting like they're innocent but they are not look at how no you know that pinocchio nose <laughs> These people are not innocent, okay? Period. They are strategizing. They're thinking that they're playing chess, but they're really playing checkers. This person may smoke, smoke, maybe even do like smoking pipes or um cigars, okay? You see how this person's hands are cut up? Somebody here is doing blood work. Somebody here is doing blood magic, but they're acting like they're innocent. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times, you can't get fooled again. 45, 45 on the clock. This person, look at all that blood. Somebody here is not who they said that they are. Gemini. This person is not who they say that they are. Gemini, this concludes your reading. I am letting this message end here. If you got anything from this message and you resonated, hit that like button, hit that share button, but also hit that subscribe button so you won't miss when I upload more content and when I go live. Until next time, love and light, my beautiful souls. I will see you all very soon. We gotta clear the energy. I normally end it here, but we're gonna do it again. We gotta clear this energy. Holy Spirit, asking that you remove any energies, any roadblocks, any hindrances, any restrictions that cropped up in this reading. We are asking that it be returned to sender ten times fold. No weapon formed against us will prosper. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. And so it is done. Bye.